NCAA football 14 pregame show presented by Nissan. Innovation that excites. Nobody wants to go to an ice cream store called Just Vanilla. You have just one flavor. There are a lot of different ways to get it done. And we're going to be watching a couple of ways to get it done on the football field today. And as a fan of the game, it's going to be a great treat just to watch these two squads, one of whom wants to pitch it all over the yard and go fast, the other one who wants to control the tempo with a physical attack. Seeing these two teams go head-to-head -head is going to be a great treat. Thanks for joining us here on the NCAA College Football Pregame Show. Now let's send it out to Brad and Kirk for all the action. We'll see you at the half. up for the kickoff and we're just about set to get this one underway he makes it out to maybe the 30 yard line seniors are throwing on the home jerseys for the final time in their career for these kids an awfully emotional time you always want to go out in style and get a win the quarterback brings his troops out onto the field for the first drive of the game He's taken off, and down he goes at the 47. He made a real nice play on that one. I'll tell you what, in today's game, you have to have the ability to run the football. Give the quarterback a lot of credit. He made a great play and really gave his team a boost. yard line and he has a huge game yeah i like the decision making ability of this quarterback he looks and looks he sees nothing he didn't get rattled he sees some green in front of him and he takes off ends up with a great run the quarterback in the gun with five receivers makes it to the 34 that makes it second and two like the defense was ready for it and they'll move the chain from the 21 yard line first down got off the left side makes it out to maybe the 19 yard line call it a gain of two yards that'll make it second and seven man left man left around the 18 yard line that's good for a gain of one yard third down throws in a hurry 
Good job here by the defense. If you let this quarterback set and throw, he'll kill you all game. But they got excellent pressure on that play. And it's the offense that takes the field on fourth down. Fires quick out to the receiver, and he can't make the grab. Change of quarterback, Herbie. you got to wonder what that's going to do to the team morale. It is next man up. They've got to be ready to trust this guy. The quarterback leads the team out on the field for the first drive. There's a fumble. He picks it up. So after the mishap, we've got first down going the other way. Often you'll see this from a playmaker. He tried to do a little bit extra and ended up losing the ball. It's a nice play by the defense to recover that ball. I don't think either team has a clear advantage so far. Let's see if they can make some plays and get a little separation. Delivers to the halfback on the screen. Knocked out of bounds. Right around the 18-yard line. That brings up second and five. Roger, Roger. Check 59, Mike. They're back in the red zone where they have really struggled lately. Pitches back. And they make the stop right around the 16-yard line. That's good for a gain of two yards. That makes it third and three. Hey, I'm coming after you. I'm coming after you. Check 59. Mike. Mike is 59. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Check 52. Right that back. Three. Three. Flips it. Middle to the running back. He's tackled around the 10-yard line. Hey, it's a, it's a first down for this offense that keeps everybody enthusiastic. You can see the momentum that this offense is gaining. The coaches and the players on the sideline are fired up. And, hey, it's a new set of downs. the middle for a nice game. That makes it second and six. He's taken down right around the 10-yard line. The defense was just all over that play. It didn't fool anybody. Third down again. Man left, man left. Four down, four down. Let's go, let's go. They'll spread the field here. Let's see what the defense does with a five wide outlook. Throws incomplete. Broken up. Nice play by the defense to bring up fourth down. The defender made a solid effort to get to the ball there. Nice stop. Trying to take the lead by a field goal. Kicks up, and he got it. Time for an update from the studio. Reese, what have you got? The Bulls were ranked 24th. Now the loss is likely to knock them out of the poll. And for Temple, they've now won three in a row. And for Utley, he pitched it around for more than 250 yards. The Owls top it off with a seven-point win. Wow. You can feel the shockwave caused by that upset all the way to our game. Johnson gets set to kick this one away. And it goes into the end zone, down for a touchback. Well, that's what happens when you play in a place like this, Herbie. The team just feeds off this crowd. And there's no doubt. That's what makes this such a tough environment. You can see the defense and the energy and what they're playing with here early in this game. And it's going to be a tough day for this offense to put points up against them. And while they are behind, they know they can knock things up in a heartbeat. It's way too early to change the game plan. Tackled after a decent pickup. Dukes gains about four yards on the play. That makes it second and six. Second and six coming up here. Ball on the 29-yard line. He makes his way to about the 38. That's a gain of nine on the play. First down. And he 
carries the ball for a nice game. Dukes gains about five yards on the run. That brings up second and five. Second down and five. Ball on their own 43. Fires quickly to the fullback. He's out of bounds at the 46. three yards to get the first down here on third down. It is out of the ball is up for grabs. Recovered by the offense. Mullins back deep to return. <laughs> Lindsay's the guy everyone has their eyes on right now, Kirk, and he comes with a lot of expectations. Time will only tell if he's the new hope or if he's all hype. Three points was the result of their last drive as the offense heads out for another. Has some daylight. He's to the 10. Makes it out to about the 13. Three-yard line. That'll make it second and inches. And he's taken down right around the 34. That makes it first and ten. They give to the tailback, and they get nice yardage on that run. That's good for a game of five yards. That'll make it second and four. That's a great tackle at the 47 yard line. Gain of two yards. That'll bring up third and two. It's third down, and they're about two yards shy of the sticks. This game's already shaping up to be a good one as we head to the second quarter. Three, nothing. Welcome back here. We resume action now here in the second quarter. They'll wrestle him down in the backfield. You keep gaining negative yards, and you put yourself in a position of having to make bigger and bigger plays. Puts a lot of pressure on that quarterback. Kirk, we saw this guy head to the locker room a little bit earlier. Good to see him back on the sideline, and it looks like he could be returning to the game. The defense has everybody on the line. I think they're going to come after this one. 
little too much leg into that punt. They'll bring it out to the 20. I just love to watch this defense play. They've been flying all over the field today, making big play after big play. The crazy thing is, we still have such a close game despite how well they play. With one quarter down, I really haven't seen too much separation between these two squads. Might be neck and neck the whole way. And they'll bring him down behind the line. Second down, about 12 yards to go. Ball on their own 18. They'll get him for a loss. Great job by the defense of getting after that quarterback. And right now, I think they've got him with some happy feet. He appears to be a bit rattled. From their own 17 yard line. Third down. Gets it out in a hurry. What great concentration. He left his feet, made the catch, and managed to secure it when he hit the ground. That was just sensational. in the world. Well, I don't know how anybody can throw a great pass while getting drilled like that. It's second and ten. Ball on the 43. Fires it out. They completed it, but for a minimal gain. It's not much, but at least it's positive yards. That brings up third and ten. Lawson is the punter. And he's taken down to 37-yard line. In a game that's this close, you can't afford to waste possessions. his way to the 49-yard line. to the 38-yard line. Three-yard gain by the running back. And that's the freshman who got in on that tackle. That makes it second and eight. Here's an opening. Nice run up the middle. Gain of six yards. Third down. He fights forwards about the 29. The offense coordinator has to be elated with the way his offense right now is executed. They're not in a hurry, but they're very, very methodical and very consistent with their approach. That's a third first down that they picked up on this drive. Tackle. 
tackle outside after a nice pickup. Call it a gain of four yards. That makes it second and six. From the 25-yard line, it's second down. Tackled for a loss. More plays like this, and the coaching staff is going to need to change up the blocking schemes. You can't allow the defense to play in your backfield. Roger, Roger. Check 59. Mike. Mike is 59. Mike is 59. Check, 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 check. Slim, slim. Three, three, three. Here's a screen to the wideout. He's all the way home. Touchdown. Excellent play here by the quarterback, making the proper reads and finding his playmaker for the score. He makes the PAT. An eight-play, 62-yard drive, and a touchdown as a result. Brad, that's one of those drives that can just tear your heart out. It can really demoralize a defense when they drive the ball down the field, and a lot of the yards came on the ground. And it looks like they're ready for the kickoff. He sends this one deep. He's to the 20. Tackle at the 23. Eaton's coaching staff, I think, Kirk at halftime, they've got to pull this kid over in the corner and let some of the coaches take care of the rest of the group and sit him down and say, what is going on? Well, I think he's that important to this offense. They know for them to be able to come back and win this game in the second half, the only chance they have is to be able to get their quarterback, kind of their, their go-to guy, and make sure he has the right mindset and make sure he still has the confidence to be able to lead this team in the second half to be able to win this game. Because if he's not right, they have no shot of winning the game. Super effort by the tailback to pick up a nice gain in a first down. He's really a good-looking ball carrier. First and 10, ball on the 38. Down he goes, around the 46-yard line. It's the intended receiver on the play. That makes it second and two. Cut and left, cut and left. Go down, go down. Let's go, let's go. Here we got Mike, number 53. Mike, 53. One, two, three. One, two, three. One, two, three. Tackle made right around the 46-yard line. So it's third down, and they've got about two yards to go. And he tackles him hard at the 46-yard line. That's a gain of eight on the play. First down. He's tackled at the 33. The pass results in a first down. I'll tell you, great call by the coaches on first down. It stretches the defense when they're expecting the run, and then they end up with another first down. From the 33-yard line, first down. Just throws this one away. Even though they didn't sack him, the pressure was still enough to force a bad pass. If you can get in there and disrupt the pocket, then the quarterback is going to have a tougher time getting the ball to his playmakers. Stays in bounds and made a nice catch. That's a gain of 12 on the play. That makes it first and ten. And this play is number eight on the drive. He's gobbled up in the backfield. Well, the question now is how will they respond after losing a couple on that run? The offense calls a timeout. It's second and twelve. Ball on the twenty-two yard line. Quick 
throw, and he's got the tight end again. The offense calls a timeout. Tight ends can really be a wild card in any offense. Sometimes the defense are a little bit confused on how to handle them. Tenth play of the drive. Brought down at the eight. He gains a couple of yards on the carry. That makes it second and eight. And he just gets rid of it. Brad, I just think this quarterback's got to do a much better job of being able to read that defense and make quicker decisions. And especially when the defense starts to get pressure, you've got to either get rid of that football or check it down or take off and run with it. Steps out of bounds at the eight-yard line. Back to the line of scrimmage, and that's it. Doesn't look like this defense is going to let them beat them with the deep passes. So they'll allow those short completions to the tight end. They're going to go for the easy three here. And they can make this a one-possession game with this kick right here. The kick is up, and they tack on three points. The kicker looks like he's ready to kick this one off. Mullins fields it at the three. And he makes it out to about the 24-yard line. You know, we're getting so used to pinball football with a lot of points. Kind of fun to see defenses play this way. Kind of refreshing, isn't it? I mean, every single week we call games, and you're seeing scores in the 30s and 40s. This is one of those low-scoring games. Which offense will get that big break? Eventually, it could be the team that wins it. Momentum swings have been fairly even. And with so little separation, this game can be drastically changed on just one or two plays. Here's the halfback on the screen. He goes out of bounds around the 23-yard line. Loss of one on the play. That'll bring up second and 11. From their own 23-yard line, it's second down. He hits him hard at the 33-yard line. The offense calls a timeout, and they'll have two remaining. He's taken down at the 29-yard line. The defense calls a timeout. Whitworth awaiting the return. And down he goes at the 40 yard line. Return for the eight yards. In a game that's this close, you can't afford to waste possessions. the toughness here by this quarterback sitting in until the last second trying to make a play downfield only to have this defense get to him. He's got to do a better job maybe feeling things out a little bit but at least he has the awareness and a toughness to sit in that pocket. There's a strike complete. He's tackled right around the 48-yard line. A great first half comes to a close. 10-3. Glad to have you with us in the studio for the EA Sports NCAA Football 14 Halftime Show presented by Nissan. Innovation that excites. Reese Davis and David Pollock here completely locked in on that first half. Things are straight defensive out there right now. David, what do these two offenses have to do to open this game up? Well, it's it's fun to watch because obviously I'm a defensive guy and I enjoy this, but when, you're, when your defense is executed at that kind of level, the offense has to be precise. I mean, you got to throw it in tight windows. You got to be willing to take some chances that you normally wouldn't have. How about some trick plays, maybe? I mean, when you're losing the battle in the trenches, you got to find some way to kind of even it out. Maybe get a little bit more options, some reverses, some double passes, something to loosen up this defense. Because right now, defenses are just winning out. Looking forward to seeing this second half. I think there's certainly a want for victory. A want and a need for victory. Some teams need this victory, Reese Davis. Want, need. Got to go get it either way. Brad and Kirk are there to deliver. All 
right, Reese and David, welcome back, everybody. Just about set to start the second half. Nice kick, plenty of distance. This one's going to be down in the end zone for a touchback. There's still plenty of time to keep running their offense as usual here. I don't think they need to feel any anxiety about trailing. Quick toss. Makes the grab and steps out right away. Well, the quarterback's able to find a soft spot in the defense, and he threw an accurate ball for a solid pickup. From their own 43-yard line, it's first down. After a decent run up the gut. That makes it second and six. Tackle at the 49. The back gets three on the carry. The sophomore just stuck it to the ball carrier right there. That's a very good tackle. It's third down, and they're about two yards shy of the sticks. Nice run, and he's brought down. And a nice run by the tailback. Not a lot of razzle-dazzle here, but it gets the job done and picks up the first down. is tipped away. It's an intelligent play by the defender. All you have to do sometimes is get your hand on the ball. That makes it second and ten. Second and ten. Ball on the 45. Quick throw incomplete. One of his receiver. Butler is the intended receiver on the play. That brings up third and ten. Flips it middle to the running back. And he's taken down at the 44. That screen play gets him a yard at the most. Better bring up fourth and nine. This punt, if he gets it where he wants, it can really change the field position in this football game. It's a short kick. They're ready to begin another drive. Moss, left side. And they make the stop around the 35 yard line. Five yards on the run. That brings up second and five. Larry, Larry, Larry. Check 59. Mike, Mike is 59. Mike is 59. No way. Go. Go. There he goes. He takes it right side for a good game. tools that he brings to the table.
And he adds the extra point. A four-play, 77-yard drive. And that's good for a touchdown. Boy, that is scoring in a hurry. This offense is looking more and more explosive. So our score, 17-3. And he got all of this one. Great kick. He's to the 20, and he's tackled at the 22-yard line. You know, sometimes you see defenses play good in stretches. This has been the longest stretch I've seen one defense play in a football game in a long time. Yeah, I think the consistency is the thing that stands out. I think they got off to a great start at halftime. They made a few adjustments, and they've come out even played better, believe it or not, here in this second half. You know they'd like to do something a little more than they did on their last drive when they had to punt the ball away. If they're going to make a comeback in this game, it's going to have to start now. This offense has to get rolling. They'll bring him down at the 30-yard line. That's good for a gain of eight yards. That makes it second and two. It's second down, and they're about two yards away from the sticks. Brought down after a nice run up the middle. That's good for a gain of seven yards. First down. Double tight, double tight. Double down, double down. Let's go, let's go. Just throws this one away. The defense got some pressure and forced a bad pass. I think they've been a little bit more aggressive here with their pass rush, and that time it paid off with an incompletion. From their own 37-yard line. Second down. He makes it out to maybe the 39-yard line. That's a game of two on the play. That'll bring up third and eight. Bro's falling back and finds his man. Still on his feet. And down he goes at about the 43-yard line. That's a gain of 18 on the play. That makes it first and 10. First down, 10 to go. Ball on the 43-yard line. Carries the ball for a nice game. Makes the tackle. That's a gain of four on the play. That makes it second and six. Two times, two times. He's got room to run. Makes it out to about the 30. So with that run, they pick up another first. It's a nice job again up front by the offensive line. They're doing a good job of neutralizing the defensive front, and it's allowed them to move the ball down the field. And this is the eighth play of the drive. Looks quick to his tight end, and he can't hang on. Nash, the intended receiver on the play. That makes it second and ten. From the 30-yard line. Second down. Quick out to his receiver. Tackle made at about the 23-yard line. Game of seven on the play. That makes it third and three. And this is the tenth play of the drive. Tries to get around the corner. He gets out to about the 22-yard line. I think the play call was the right one by the offense. I just think the defense made a better play. They seem to want it more here on this big third down. Offense comes up a little bit short to set up a fourth down, but give all the credit to the personnel on the defensive side of the ball. Kicks up, and it sails through the uprights. Looks like they're ready for the kickoff. And he'll return this one from the center. Yeah. 
it's early in this game, so the defense can still have an opportunity to make some adjustments. But if things don't turn around in a hurry, it's really going to start to affect the psyche of that defensive line. Makes it to the 37. They go with the option and pick up the first down. Yeah, and that was a situation where the quarterback knew he could pick up the first down if he kept it himself. That's a good decision. Option play. The tailback gets six yards before he's brought down. Gets to about the 44 yard line. Suggs only picks up about a yard there on the option. Second and long. Ball on their own 48. Looks middle. Got his back. And he's tackled at the 25-yard line. It's not over yet, folks. We head to the fourth quarter. 17-6. Welcome back to the action here as we resume play here in quarter number four. They'll get him for a loss. Nothing doing that time. Defenders stayed home, the blocking wasn't there, and down he went. And this play is number eight on the drive. Here we go, here we go. to come away with that interception. I don't even think the quarterback saw him on that play. He was right there waiting for the ball. We've got a first and ten. Ball on the eight. Catches it, and that's all. Butler picks him up six yards with a catch. Call it a gain of six yards. That'll bring up second and three. Check tight right, tight right, tight right. Check it out, check it out. Let's go, let's go. Check, check, check. Nice run there. He'll pick up a first down with that run from the halfback. He got seven, but it looked like for a second he could have broken it for even more. Good call. From their own 21 yard line. First down.
Caught out in the open. And he shoved out of bounds at the 38-yard line. Call it a gain of 17 yards. First down. From their own 38-yard line. First down. Throws out and threw his hands. They tried to fool him by running the same play again. Well, fooled no one there, Brad. That makes it second and ten. It's third and nine. Ball on the 39-yard line. Sets up a screen. Tailback's got it. Knocked out of bounds around the 45-yard line. Game of six on the play. Fourth down. Lawson is waiting for the snap. He fields it at the 17. Brought down at the 28. Both teams are well aware that a score on this drive is going to create an almost insurmountable lead. This defense has really got to step it up and make a stop. You know, at that point, I think, Brad, the quarterback's just better off just taking a sack. You have to be very careful as you're feeling pressure to throw the ball just to throw the ball. If you feel like you're not going to be able to make a play and the defense got you, just give up on that play and get ready for the next down. Fires out to his receiver. He's taken down around the 40-yard line. Besides going deep on the fade, the slant route is probably the most commonly run route against man coverage. If the receiver gets a good inside release, it'll be a new set of downs every time. He's got the corner. He's at midfield. He's at the 40. He's pushed out of bounds right around the 34. has got to be thinking if they've already forced a red zone turnover maybe they can do it again right here he's tackled around the four yard line gain of two on the play that brings up second and goal the lineman got a little ahead of the snap count here's the call start offense well, that penalty drives them back and they're shooting themselves in the foot here well Still they can just down. keep their concentration they'll avoid situations like that from the nine yard line it's second down He's out of bounds around the five-yard line. And Kirk, that was a nice grab there. You know, it may be simple, but whenever you can gain solid yardage, you're doing something right. Less than three minutes in the game.
Dumps it complete over the middle. And he tackles him hard at the six-yard line. That is a loss of one yard on the play. That brings up fourth and goal. So it's fourth down. They'll line up for the field goal, and this is nothing more than a chip shot. Kick is up, and it's through the uprights. Johnson has the ball all teed up, and he's ready to kick this one off. Whitworth fields it at the two. Tackle at the 26-yard line. You know, sometimes self-scouting is the best thing you can do, and I don't think they did a very good job of that. It's another example of no matter how good you are or no matter how good you've been in the past, you have to continue to evolve as an offense. And this offensive coordinator might look at this game plan and say, you know what, I can learn from this, and we can be better down the road. Throws it in a hurry. Tackle at about the 35. That's a gain of nine on the play. That brings up second and one. Check 31, check 31. And he's taken down at the 38. Makes the tackle. Call it a gain of three yards. First down. Switch, switch, switch. Just under two minutes in the game. And they make the stop at the 43-yard line. Call it a game of 19 yards. First check, down. check. Disco Raver. Disco Raver. Slam, slam. Go. Alert, alert, alert. Throws complete, and he stopped immediately. Thomas on the tackle at the 36-yard line. That'll bring up second and three. Might have been some early movement up front. Ball start, offense. It's so tough to move the ball forward. Even a five-yard setback can do damage to a drive. Second down, eight yards to go. Ball on the 41-yard line. And he's hit immediately. Nothing going on that play. Well, here I think the quarterback needs to be a little bit more patient in the pocket. That way he can allow his receivers to get downfield a little bit before he throws it. The offense calls a timeout. Up the middle for a nice game. The offense calls a timeout. That was their second timeout. That makes it first and ten. From the 31-yard line. It's first down. And they got it. Jones with the second. Lost some nine yards on the play. That'll make it second and long. Shift. Watch the shift. The spike will stop the clock. That'll bring up third and long. And this is the ninth play of the current drive. We have less than a minute to go. That's a great tackle at the 46. Call a loss of six yards on the play. Makes it fourth and nine. So the big blow comes from the defense. They come up with the stop of the day, and that'll ice this football game. And they'll fail on fourth down. They're ready to begin another drive. And this should be a kneel down as they just try to kill the clock. Takes a knee. The defense calls a timeout.
offensive coordinator, you love this play. His quarterback will take a knee.